Patients with resectable non-small cell lung cancer often have disease relapse after surgery with curative intent. The addition of the anti-programmed DEATH1 antibody nivolumab to chemotherapy in the neoadjuvant treatment period improves event-free survival in these patients. In a new trial, investigators examine whether the addition of nivolumab as a perioperative treatment, that is, neoadjuvant therapy followed by surgery and adjuvant therapy, might improve outcomes further. In this Phase 3 randomized double-blind trial, 461 patients with resectable stage 2A to 3B non-small cell lung cancer were assigned in the neoadjuvant period to receive nivolumab plus chemotherapy or chemotherapy plus placebo every three weeks for four cycles. During the adjuvant period, which began within 90 days after surgery, the respective groups received nivolumab or placebo every four weeks for one year. The primary outcome, event-free survival, was significantly longer in the nivolumab group. At 18 months, an estimated 70.2% of the patients in the nivolumab group were alive, as compared with 50% in the chemotherapy group. Among secondary outcomes, Pathological complete response occurred more frequently in the nivolumab group than in the chemotherapy group, as did major pathological response. Patients receiving nivolumab had a higher frequency of grade 3 or 4 treatment-related adverse events than patients receiving chemotherapy alone. No new safety signals were reported with nivolumab. The authors conclude that in patients with resectable non-small cell lung cancer, the use of nivolumab as a perioperative treatment resulted in a significant event-free survival benefit and improved pathological response rates as compared with chemotherapy alone. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.